Yo, welcome to my YouTube page, Wiggity. Welcome to my YouTube page. Subscribe, rate, review. Leave a comment. You could talk trash. I'm responding to the comments. I read them all. Leave a comment. I might hit you back. Nonetheless, welcome to my YouTube page. I want to start sort of confessing here uh, uh, about what I eat on the road. I, I, I need to confess. I, I think this is a good place to confess because um, I, I, have to, I have to figure this out because I'm looking good. I mean, look at me. 52. I'm going to be 53 in March. Looking good. Okay? I mean, there's other people that look better, but I'm looking pretty good. And I do well. I, I, I have been consistent. <clears throat> My working out's been great. I did a six-minute plank. Six minutes of planking. And, and, and sometimes people on social media, and I'm going to post this on social media. Sometimes people on social media go, Mike, Mike Rapp, White Mike, uh, Gringo Mandingo, uh, Inflamed Ashkenazi, uh, uh, Mr. Sunshine. How come you don't post positive things? Well, here I am. I did a six-minute plank. Six minutes. Okay, this post is only one minute, and it's going to feel real long. Six minutes of planking. And I'm just going to say this. If I could fucking do it, you could fucking do it. How's that for positivity? If I could fucking do it, you could fucking six-minute plank as well. You like that for positivity, you fucks you? You don't do positivity. What am I supposed to do on, on social media? I don't, have, I don't have puppies. Am I supposed to, you know, copy and paste all the other? I, I, I put them in my stories. I like them. The puppies, the, the monkeys. I saw two turtles swimming. They were like slap boxing. These things warm my heart. This is not, this is not my content. Okay? I just gave you positivity. I planked for six minutes, and I'm proud of myself. And if I could plank for six minutes, you can plank for six minutes. Be inspired by that. Is that inspiring? Is that positive enough? Jesus Christ. You want some positivity? Go look at some, some kitten videos. What the fuck you want from me? But that's not the point. The point is, is that I need to come to terms with, with, with what's happening on the road. Now, I will be back on the road again, the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd of December. The 1st, the 2nd, and the 3rd of December, I'm going to be in Florida, Miami, at the Miami Improv, okay? Then on the 8th, 9th, and 10th, back in Portland, great club in Portland, 8th, 9th, and 10th, December. Then the 15th, 16th, and 17th, I'm in Pleasanton, California, up there at Tommy T's, okay? And then we're done for the year. All tickets, all information is available at Michael Rappaport Comedy. Dot com, Michael Rappaport Comedy dot com. We got Miami, we got Portland, and then we got Pleasanton, California, NorCal. Unfortunately, the Golden State Warriors will not be in town when I'm up there. But when I'm on the road, it, 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 it's, it's, it's tough. Because I get there and the first thing I do is I, I try. I look on my Happy Cow app. There's an app called Happy Cow, vegetarian, vegan. They say, Mike Rapp, are you vegetarian, vegan? No, but I try. Try my best. I don't want to go to Chipotle. No disrespect to Chipotle. When I have it, it, it ain't bad. But I, 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 first thing I try to do is eat a good, healthy meal. And, and no disrespect to St. Louis. It was, it, not a lot was coming up on my Happy Cow vegetarian vegan app in St. Louis. But I ate, I ate something good. And then I, I get to the club, comedy clubs, and, and the menus on there, it's the first thing you see are our custom made, our uh, home, our, you know, uh, perfectly made, whatever adjectives, verbs they're using, chicken fingers. And then it's all downhill. It's chicken fingers, it's mozzarella sticks, it's buffalo wings, it's sliders, blue cheese sliders, fried chicken sliders. Uh, uh, bacon, lettuce, and tomato slice. It's just all that. And it's just luring me in. And, and I'm, just, I'm just confessing. I, I, I'm just confessing here. What happened, what happened when I got to the comedy club is, is, is chicken tenders, mozzarella sticks. And then I had went to this place called Crown Candy, 
which is the, the oldest, like, uh, you know, sort of um, diner in St. Louis. It's been there since 1913, little hole in the wall. And they were nice to me, really nice to me. It's in a part of town called Northern St. Louis. And I'm just going to say this, no disrespect to St. Louis or Northern St. Louis, but you don't want to be caught after dark near that fucking crown candy. There ain't nothing around there. It, it, I'm surprised they don't film like a zombie, a zombie movie out there in Northern St. Louis. And nothing. People are like, uh, 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 well, uh, you know, uh, you shouldn't walk around here after dark. I'm like, there's no one here. There's no buildings. There's no homeless people. There's nothing. Blocks and blocks and blocks of nothing. Literally, it's like, it's like a back lot for a Hollywood show. Like you could film Zombieland St. Louis in Northern St. Louis. No disrespect. But the people from Crown Candy, they sent over a box of candy. What am I supposed to do? Am, am I supposed to just reject it? A, a, am I supposed to not uh, receive it? And I put it on the table. It's taped up. And the next thing you know, I'm, un, I'm untaping it. And I try one. I'm trying two. I'm double. I, I'm, I go home. I'm shitting Crown Candy. I'm shitting uh, Buffalo Sliders. And, and, and then... I don't do this in real life. The point, that's the point. I don't do this in real life. It's only when I'm on the road and now I have to go to Miami. You know what the temptation is in Miami? The things to eat, the tacos, the beef tacos, and then Portland. There's nothing healthy about, well, actually people are on that green juice shit out there. It's just my own personal struggle. I'm struggling, struggling on the road. And then I, I fly, I wake up early in the morning, uh, uh, Sundays, I'm bloated. Uh, uh, my body's confused. I'm on the plane. Uh, uh, it's a short flight. It's just, and then I come back and it's football and I can't sleep. And, and, and then you got Real Housewives of Potomac and, and I'm now watching Temptation Island. I, it, it's just, anyway, this is just my struggle on the road. Uh, and I'm trying to figure out what to do. I'm trying to figure out what to do. I'm not going to bring like kale chips with me to Portland and kale chips with me to Pleasanton, California. I have to be tougher. I did work out though, like I said, six minute plank. I said that once, I said it twice. I said it three times now. If I could do a six-minute plank, I am telling you, because people are like, oh, shit. They're impressed with that six-minute plank. If I can do it, you can do it. If I could fucking do it, you can fucking do it. Yo, thank you for watching. Leave a comment, rate, review. You can leave a comment. It could be good. It could be bad. It could be somewhere in the middle. I might respond. Welcome. Thanks for watching.